If they're doing it again next year or whenever, I would, I would do it again. Something that has been in my back garden for my whole life and I never have ever done it. I do remember as a child spending time in Shannon Bridge doing uh, just around Shannon Bridge itself but I've never actually done the full trip all the way back home. It was beautiful and just to see the surroundings and what's at my uh, back garden basically. I was pleasantly surprised and it was lovely to kind of catch up with people I've gone to school with that I haven't seen since I left school. Um, that I didn't expect to see. So it was just lovely, yeah. No, absolutely, my family enjoyed it. Mum and Dad were here as well, um, which is really, really nice, yeah. Uh, nothing really surprised me. It's just a nice, pleasant, relaxing way to move from Shannon Bridge. When I was living here in Van uh, as a younger person, we would often go out to Shannon Bridge, uh, but that time there wasn't a boat way up uh, as far as Van So So we got to, um, uh, one or two of the pubs at Shannon Bridge have a, have a drink and come back uh, by, by road. So it was nice to be able to do it by the river. So I've never done that, the whole lock experience. Uh, it was uh, very enjoyable. Everyone was amazed by it. The kids just loved it, like just watching it. It's the trip about uh, the community and really kind of um, everyone coming together and seeing what Ballinslow has to offer. As a native of Ballinslow, I didn't realise how much until I've moved home, what we've got to offer as a town um, from a tourist perspective, from people moving back home, from locals in general, uh, there's so much out there. I, I'm surprised it's not a regular event and uh, landing back here in the Moy Carn and, and even going to Ballinslow, it's just lovely to just be here, you know, so I highly recommend and it's something that Ballinslow as a town we, we should really definitely look at for our tourists because it's, it's, it's absolutely fabulous.